as if Raymer's like giving up stage position over and over to get his, you know, five damage bullet, you know, three damage bullet. Three, yeah. Um, two, he's not making one, a lot of progress. Go. Right. So I'm wave dash arena for this first game. We looks got like a this hand warmer uh, here. Yeah, looks check. like it. This guy's moving all over the stage. And again, it's so important in a in a game like this because you have to learn to adapt to icon systems and its mechanics as opposed to other platform fighters. It's not the same, you know? Yeah, it's not the same. It's certainly pretty familiar, but we see all the, the really strong players in this game have been putting a lot of time into icons specifically, yes. rather than coasting off of you know what their fundamentals might be oh, from yeah. other games. Yeah, we had a few melee crossover entrants, and they did not do <laughs> particularly <laughs> well. Let's say that it happens. Yeah. You got you got to put the time in if you're looking to succeed. Absolutely, yeah. So here we go, Wei Shan against Raymer on. It looks like if we're going to Wave Dash Arena, yeah, that's what we struck to. So this has kind of been the favorite stage Three, across the board two, for pretty much one. everybody. Go. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I mean, this stage is great. I love playing on it. What do you think? You like it? No. See, th this is the thing. So this stage is very remit. Uh oh. Uh, uh, oh, uh oh. We already got an SD. Well, uh, is that the first? That's the first like SD we've seen though. I like think, right? literally like, zero percent SD. Yeah. Right. I think so. Yeah. Um. I'm, I'm a, I like this stage, but I'm more of like the old school. Like it feels like people either like this stage layout if they're the new school, or they like Smashville if they're the old school. You know what I mean? Like the one platform that's moving. I'm very old school in that regard. What about like Cryo Station, right? Oh like yeah, the, that's the my tri -plats, stage. That's yep. like super old school. Tri Plats right? is my joint. Yeah, I'm, I'm much more of a Tri Plats guy. And it looks like uh, Jokomo is really taking that SD and running with it. You know? Yes. Like, he has barely gotten scratched since uh, Tandori respawned after that unfortunate SD. Yeah. Some people, like when your opponent SDs, they'll play a little bit softer, you know, play with a lead, and they'll be like, all right, well, I have a lot of chips to bet with. I'll be fine here. But Jokomo, no, taking nothing for granted. <laughs> See him dance around trying to hit that four oh, yeah. air. He takes no prisoners out here. See, up there into the forward air. Nice stuff. Get the shot. Guns out. <laughs> A back Very throw? good, yeah. patient shield grab. If yes. he had shield grabbed immediately, then the down, uh, the dash attack would have gone under it. Yeah. But uh, Jokum was really wary of that low profile. And yeah. It's like I'm gonna wait until you stand back up and then get get my grab going. Definitely. See the jab right there. Weishan still with three stocks. Tandori has a, an enormous mountain to climb if he wants to be able to take this set. Yeah, we good saw stuff. this against uh, Morse Code where if he comes down with the second swing of ups. Of special, okay. oh. then uh, and hits uh, up high on the shield. Yes. Then uh, Raymer gets a free grab, and that forward throw is really good for setting up an edge grab. Yeah. If not just killing outright, absolutely can be super strong. Right now, 72 percent on Tandori. You might just this is one of those situations where you might just want to consider the game a lost cause. However, okay, I was gonna say if he can get some kind of nice edge guard, he might be able to do it. But this is just rough. Yeah, this is looking pretty pretty rough for Tandori here. He's got a lot of work to do to you know, try to close this out. But hopefully he can at least get some more information to, yes, to, of to course. bring it into the next games. And I think that's going to close it out. Yeah, the forward air, really strong, lots of startup, and uh, really making use of the Guan out there. Absolutely, yeah. So I'm wondering how this set's going to go in this next match if there's no SD on that. And I'm not sure how the banning process works in these best of fives. Is there there, there are, are no stage no, bans in best of five? We we only have five stages, Three, so two, I mean, if you ban stages, one, then it's like, go. all right, I guess we're playing on pencil and paper now, right? Yeah. Like, okay. That makes gotta sense. have a locale for the combat. I feel you. So we're back to Wave Dash Arena. Tandori, I think, deciding, you know, all right, well, that was the stage more than, or that was me more than anything, not the stage. He gets busted by that Guan Dial there. No, yeah. Missed yeah. timing the shield gust there. Uh, Jokomo hadn't quite gotten up to, up to the ledge yet. Yeah, and the reason that you want to do that is because it's very hard to really punish Weishan recovering low. But if you use that shield gust at the right time, it kind of pushes him up. He can use his up B again, but it puts him in an awful position where you can just kind of stuff him. Yeah, it really puts Weishan in a situation where it's difficult for him to sweet spot again. Yeah. Um, and you know, that... The, the up, up special is really hard to edge guard, like directly contest because of the Guan Dao and the positioning of his hands and stuff. Yeah. Um, the best way to do it is to be under him or behind him. Yeah. And the shield gust really sets that up really well. 
it's like, all right, you're going up, you're going, you're going forward, and I can like jump yeah. over you in back air or do something like that. Yeah. There, yeah. up to 27% as Tandori takes that first stock. Back throw here, get him off stage, maybe try for an edge guard, nice. and got yeah. him. Uh, Jokoma is really showing that he is uh, not just going to wait until they use it up special and hit them. He's, right. He's like, all right, if you're going to go down low every single time, I'm going to hit you for it. Yeah. And that, that pop back, uh, back air, where you just kind of immediately jump off and do a back air is so powerful. It's really satisfying to watch, too. Oh, yeah. Commentators get to say nice back air. It's just, <laughs> it's just all around good for the whole family. Very fun, yeah. Very even game. Excellent shield gust right Shoots there. Shoots it back. Good reaction time on that. Telling Tandori to be more careful with his shots. There you go, the fourth throw into the shot. Got another shot. That should be it. Yeah. Yep. Not whenever, even close enough to threaten with the hitboxes. Yeah, whenever you're off stage against Raymer, you have to be very careful in terms of your recovery because you can just get stuffed out by something like that. He's in another recovery situation right here, forced to get back to the ledge. Now Tandori's the one on the ropes. Yeah, he smelled a roll in. Yeah, I mean, at lower percents, that down special is very potent because a lot of players get caught unaware and they try to attack. Like, oh, well, you got this big startup moves, time to attack. Yes, yeah. But the armor really helps Wishan get through a lot of attacks. Definitely. But a seasoned player like yeah. Tandori, gr grinding a lot online, he's ready. He's like, all right, I'm going to wait for the end lag. Yeah. Come in with a punish after. You know, 87% on Jokomo with a pretty significant uh, deficit, but nothing insurmountable. Especially not for Weishan. He's got big yes. damage on his attacks. Yeah, his oh, damage wow. is insane, that's it. but the reverse forward tilt, is there one, nothing two. that move can't do? It's incredible. Files your taxes for you. It's, you know, waters your crops. It's insane. Rainbow side tilt, everybody. All right, so that's going to be 1-1 one, one in the set so far. Uh, Malu Malu, I think, might be the pick. Yeah, there we go. Easy yeah, peasy. Not nearly as much room for Rainbow to try to, like, run Three, around and two, uh, one, evade Weishan. <laughs> And, you know, Weishan's huge Guandao moves are going to be applying a lot of pressure. You, you get to cover a larger percentage of the overall um, enclosed space of combat with yes. your Guandao if you go to a smaller stage. You see moves like his neutral air and his up tilt cover so much range, make it really hard for Rain to do anything. Answers the down special with a down special of his own. Yeah, super smart. Oh, and there it is again. Tandori has to be a lot more careful in how he's using wow, that the reverse hit of Nair. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, his bubble around him during that nair is just so oppressive. You have to respect him. It's so scary. The down throw, forward air, or da dash tag. Interesting. The pole vault dash tag. He's dancing. Finally gets the jab. Tries to get the reverse up tilt. Not going to happen, but he does get the back air. Oh, no. Oh, that, that might do it. it. Yeah, yeah put him in a off terrible Off of the eye after that down special bullet hit him. Yeah, I think he was holding down still. Double jab. <laughs> got some clanks. Ding, ding. Everybody's trying to jab. Oh, gosh, yeah. Wow. Not the best DI there. Really need to get good DI if you're going to live for any reasonable amount of sta time on this stage. I've yeah. seen from both players already. Yeah, that's just Malu Malu, man. You get knocked off, and you're dead at 80 if you're not careful. He gets the fourth throw, trying to get the recovery, but it's not going to happen. Wall jump, all keeping he had to do it was tricky. keep holding shield, and I think he could have gotten it, but I don't know if that's a shield poke or what. I think the wall jump really messed with the timing there. Could have been. Should just not doing anything against that ricochet shot. So these guys both trying to land a hit here. Oh, dash is through him. Yeah, a lot of patient neutral here. Nobody wants to end up off stage on yes. this stage, it seems. There, gets the shot to 105. Two, he's off stage, and one. he's going to yeah. juggle him all the way off. Get the three-piece combo with the good shots there. Yeah, those are not always easy to set up. You have to kind of be in your opponent's head for a lot of it. Yeah, like, in each of those situations, it's like, all right, he's going to just drift towards the stage and not jump. The next one, all right, he's going to jump here. Yes. And uh, Pandora's really putting himself in good positions to really abuse Wei Shang's recovery. Yeah, but there's wins. the fourth strike. Guan Dao, just so much range and power. Yeah, so big. Even if you recover the platform, he's going to get you. Yeah. So that'll do it. Jokomo now up 2-1 on Tandori, who has the option of the counter pick. Not really sure what would be his best stage to go to, but Cryo Station, stage we haven't seen like much today at all, honestly. Three, two, uh, this might one, be the first time. Go. I believe so. 
We're starting off with a gun. More gun. One of my friends pointed it out to me too, that planet in the background rotates so fast. Like, can you imagine being on that planet? You're just moving all the time. Yeah, your, just... your day's about uh, an hour. Yeah, exactly. It's super funny. Oh, excellent hit on that forward air. And now Jokobo just sitting pretty in an excellent spot to take this set. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, like, Raymer really thrives when he has the lead. Yes. And uh, you can say the same about Weishan. Weishan has no impetus to approach right here. Right. He's like, all right, I'm going to sit in the center of the stage, throw out my big moves, try to deal with it. Yeah. Um, and Tandori, it's really on him to try to come in and... Wow! Oh, wow, he, he waits the whole time. all the way out. <laughs> it wasn't enough to get a stock, but definitely He's got the future sight there. Yeah, that was beautiful. He did an anime glasses push after that one. Oh, double strike on that fourth strike. Gets both hits. Oh, no. Wow, catches him coming down with the neutral air. Yeah, and this, this might be the end for him. Tandori just in a very bad spot here. He's trying to yeah. make something happen, but... As Raymer, after you get somebody to shield gust, like, incorrectly, it's really your cue to go in, because yes. their shield is their only line of defense against all of your great normals. That's true, yeah. Um, so you, you maybe get a get a ricochet at a good good angle, yeah. get, them to, get them to mess up the shield gust, and then come in with your jabs, come in with your side tilt. You can see him shield gust the Weishan up special, but unfortunately he couldn't get anything out of it. There's the up strike, and now Tandori with a huge hill to climb here. Yeah, might be a bit too stocks. little too late here in this game four. This is not looking good. Has him on the platform, though. That could be a very good position as Raymer to have your opponent and see what the edge guard situation is. Misses his shot, unfortunately. Does not get the shield gust out in time before Jokomo grabs the ledge. Oh, and this is looking like it's it. Yeah, yeah. the neutral air there after the jab. We'll close it out, and Jokomo will advance to lose the semifinals. Yeah, it's that, it's that Nair, man. It is such a huge circle around him, and it's so deceptively strong.